Welcome to our lecture online. Here's our next example of how to find a solution to a first order non-homogeneous linear differential equation. Y prime plus 5y equals e to 2x plus 4. Notice that this is the general form of the uh, equation and it is in the proper form and this is the general solution to the equation realizing that h is equal to the integral of f dx. Notice that f is the the um, function in front of the y and r would be this quantity right here. So let's go ahead and identify what these are. So in our example f is equal to 5, r is equal to e to the 2x plus 4 and then h is equal to the integral of f dx which is equal to the integral of 5 times dx which is equal to 5 times x. So in this case, h is 5x. So now we're ready to go ahead and plug those numbers in into our general solution. So y is equal to e to the minus h. h is 5x, so e to the minus 5x times the quantity, the integral of e to the h, which is e to the 5x times r. r would be equal to e to the 2x plus 4 times dx plus a constant of integration. Okay, now let's simplify this expression. Um, we need to integrate this, but before we integrate it, let's multiply this out. So we have y is equal to e to the minus 5x times the quantity, that would be e to the 7x plus 4 times e to the 5x times dx plus a constant of integration. And the integral sign, can't forget that. Okay, now in order to integrate this, I need the proper differentials. So the differential of this would be 7dx, and the differential of this would be uh, 5dx. So we can say that y is equal to e to the minus 5x times, I'm going to break up the integral, so that would be 1 7 times the integral of e to the 7x times 7dx plus 4 over 5 times the integral of e to the 5x times 5dx. So notice what I've done is I needed a differential, 7dx, and so therefore I, I multiply times 7, divide by 7, I needed a 5dx, so I also divide it by 5, and then of course plus a constant of integration. Now I'm ready to integrate both of these integrals. So y is equal to e to the minus 5x times 1 7 e to the 7x plus 4 fifths e to the 5x plus a constant of integration. And now we can go ahead and multiply this through so I get y is equal to 1 7 e to the 2x plus 4 fifths because e to the minus 5x cancels out e to the 5x plus um, e to the minus 5x times a constant. So I'll just put the constant right in front of it. So plus a constant times that. And this would then be the solution to the original differential equation. And that's how it's done.